Hey guys, so I am here uh, again in Beverly Hills, and right behind me is, uh, you've seen it in so many movies, uh, most notably the Beverly Hills Cop movies and The Last Boy Scout. This doubles as a police station, um, but in reality, it's actually Beverly Hills City Hall. Uh, and look at this, this is great. Uh, I, here I am, kind of where Bruce Willis is walking up to Damon Wayne, who's picking him up from jail. And, um, you know, over here, if you look right there, that's where the cop car pulls up and they take Eddie Murphy to jail, the first Beverly Hills cop. But you only see this, like, kind of shot outside of movies, uh, most notably, like, action films. Um, I can't name any other movies, but, but this is really awesome being here. Uh, it's really beautiful. Uh, and Beverly Hills is pretty, pretty huge. Uh, I think it's small, but it's huge, but yeah. This is it. This is the police station always using the movies. Thanks for watching, guys. Hey, guys. So I'm behind Beverly Hills City Hall, and this is kind of where uh, a movie that nobody really remembers, Beverly Hills Cop 3. This is where Eddie Murphy kind of pulls in over here, um, and he talks to like a like an automated machine and asking him what, uh, what he needs and stuff. And he's like all upset. He gets out of his car and walks off. But you can see this behind him, and you can uh, see this, like, kind of like over here uh, on his left side. But this is the actual, I, think, I believe this is the actual uh, Beverly Hills Police Department. So, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. The architecture is great. So, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Hey, guys. So, here I am um, in Santa Monica. It looks like I'm above Route 1. This house right here, this is uh, Bruce Willis's house in The Last Boy Scout. Uh, this is the house, uh, you know, he stayed with his family and him and Damon Wayans like uh, had their argument and him and Daniel Harris, Bruce Willis and Daniel Harris are like fighting each other uh, because you know, she was the daughter, he's the father and she was cursing him out. But like this, this, this is a great find. Um, and in the movie, they show the house a lot. Uh, you know, Bruce Willis's car pulls up here, and um, out a lot. There's like a. Now if you look across the street, if you look across the street, this is the the Pacific. Uh, his friend's car, uh, played by Bruce McGill, is parked in the front, and then it blows up uh, in the movie. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, go back to here. You can see it looks a little different. There's a lot of construction going on. Uh, there was a walkway going up, uh, but they, they kind of like done some digging and stuff. I don't know what's going on. I hope they don't tear it down. It's really cool. Great view. Uh, but it definitely doesn't look like a cave with uh, skulls and shit on it. So this is great. This is in Santa Monica. All right, so thanks for watching, guys. Hey, guys. Just wanted to show you my house. 1309 Hillcrest Road, big white house. Um, that's where you're gonna send me uh, anything. <laughs> now, I was just quoting Beverly Hills Cop 2. Behind me is the house that Eddie Murphy stole in Beverly Hills Cop 2 when he was just driving around the street. And if you look over there, um, there's a couple of buildings that you can see. So when you watch the scene of him driving up and the guys are doing construction on the house, you can see those buildings in the background. But this is uh, supposedly, supposed to be 1309 Hillcrest uh, Road, I believe. So, in Beverly Hills. Uh, it's a really nice house, and uh, Eddie Murphy did steal it. And he was out back in the pool, and you know, on, with his trunks, and drinking uh, margaritas, and all that stuff. Alright? Um, Alright, that's it. So, 